What is up my peeps, it is Deej here, and I've got another Skyrim Hearthfire video here for you, and we're going to build some more and furnish this house, and I'm going to give you some tips on, on how to do it in a timely manner. Uh, first off here, you can see that the on with your house, you can have three different wings, and you have three choices from those three wings, so it's t nine total things that you can add on to your house. Uh, like right here, I'm going to put an armory in here because I want some more mannequins and such. I'm going to put a uh, a alchemist tower on the, on the left side, and then I'm going to have a uh, a trophy room on the end but uh, what I'm gonna show hey who is that somebody's over here casing my place let's go check him out uh, no it's just Gregor <laughs> it was the first time I had found him and it really did freak me out. I was like who is that walking by my new house uh, anyway he is your Thane so I backed off a little but then I remembered uh, one thing about your Thanes at your new houses is you can hire them to get you supplies and even furnish your house for you if you have enough money uh, so what I did here is appoint him as my steward and uh, then he will be able to get me supplies like wood, clay, and rock, uh, or the quarried stone, uh, which is actually just right around here. If you watch my uh, first video on this, I gave you some points on uh, how all your resources are actually right here. Uh, but anyway, I didn't have a, an, an axe, so I used him to get uh, all the lumber I, I needed for all the building. Uh, anyway, he can also supply you with animals such as cows, chickens, and uh, a bard, a uh, a, uh, uh, a wagon, you know, and any uh, a carriage. Uh, anyway, let's get back to the building. Uh, so yeah, I'm, I've added on some of the wings. And uh, here is the stuff you can put on the outside, like uh, you know, a stable and whatnot. Uh, but here you uh, need you need clay, wood, and iron. So basically nails, but sometimes it's uh, locks and stuff. Uh, if you need a lock, you actually need corundum ore. But uh, yeah, anyway, you build the the walls, the roof, and you know the the foundation, just like you did with the first part of the house. But I can't stress enough that you need a lot of iron. And I'm going to give you a little tip here in a minute where to get all that. Uh, you need a bunch of nails, a few hinges, a few locks. But, uh, and by far you need a whole bunch of iron fittings and a lot of it has to go with the furnishing uh, it's mostly just nails and stuff for um, the actual building of the uh, walls and whatnot but once you get inside let's check out what I built here uh, first I had this little house here then I built on this monstrous addition and my wings aren't even set up yet so they're not even on here but this is the main hall I believe it's called uh, you know there's some bedrooms here Jesus that guy is everywhere he's I all up in my house sword. walking around I, I swear he's case in the place uh, but he sells me that? chickens and cows so, all right <laughs> uh, yeah see there barred horse carriage cow chicken uh, I need a few chickens lungs. out there hello murky uh, anyway so yeah Lucky Gregor's a pretty uh, trustable fellow um, I hear in the in the lore or the literature that some of them aren't trustable so you got to find the right people um, anyway so I haven't ran into that this is my first house we'll see if it comes into play in the other houses uh, I don't know I think this is gonna be my man cave so I don't know if I'm gonna adopt some kids for here or not uh, <clears throat> but anyway uh, like I said this is gonna be about furnishing and one thing that I didn't get before at all uh, was glass I totally overlooked it so there's a few things that I won't be able to make but uh, here in a second I'm gonna give you some tips right here actually <laughs> Uh, to find some a lot of iron, you need to go to like blacksmiths mostly. They have it, and uh, I would say pick up some leather strips as well. Uh, I picked up this silver, but it doesn't. Um, I didn't find a need for it while uh, making stuff for the house. And then you go to all these good stores, and you'll find straw and glass. I didn't see it here at first, but this is where you find straw. I couldn't find it anywhere else in the world. If anyone knows, let me know, and uh, we'll post that in the comments. But I personally didn't find any. I just bought them all from him. Uh, Bellathor and whatnot, and like here's the glass. I didn't notice it at the last place, but uh, you'll also want to pick up goat horns and any other tusks and hides that you might want to like stuff on the wall and stuff. But uh, you definitely need goat horns for sconces and whatnot and lights. Uh, pick up the troll skull as well. Uh, who you like my troll skull collection here? <laughs> uh, this is the Breeze home. This is where I keep a lot of my iron. So this is what I was gonna say is um, if you had stockpiled iron before even knowing about this, you're good to go. And I, I hit it here somewhere but I couldn't quite find it at first uh, I put certain things in different things you know I don't just mix and match I have uh, certain categories like this was all building stuff or you know stuff that you would use to make um Oh no, this looks like the junk pile. Uh, anyway, but look at that jackpot. I got 147 irons and 43 iron ores even. Uh, so that is 190 altogether once I blacksmith them. So yeah, if you have some ore, you also want to stop by the smelter on the way out to uh, back to Hierarchum Hall or whatever it is. <coughs> Your new house. <laughs> anyway, yeah, smelt that stuff. Mm. 
All right, so back to back to uh, building. Like I said, you need a few locks if you're going to add on your wings because you got to have a lock for each door. And I think for the armory it was three. Not sure, but again, a lot of iron fittings. I never, I always kept running out of iron fittings. I had a bunch of nails, hinges. I don't think I ever even had a problem with, but iron fittings nonstop. So make a bunch of those. Uh, anyway, uh, yeah, where are we? <laughs> uh, so, okay, so now that I have straw and uh, a bunch of iron and glass, I can make the display cases and just about everything in here. And uh, I also got some goat horns, so there's some chandeliers and sconces, and I even got a moose head, uh, or I guess that was an elk, but you know. Um, like I said, if you want these wolves and stuff, you got to get the pelts and uh, whatever. Uh, sometimes, like when it's a hork or you need a... Or, Sometimes you need more than just a pelt, you know what I mean? So just check whichever one you want and go out and get the goods on that. Most of them are, again, with the buying of the, the goods stores and just go out and hunting. Uh, here I am hunting out of iron fittings again. That's, like I said, is the biggest part. So here comes the army. Uh, like I said, this is uh, just another advanced video. I got a long video that's solid of me furnishing the rest of the house, uh, filling the mannequins, and giving you tips on, on all that stuff, too. So, I mean, there's another video coming after this. Yes, another Hearthfire video. Uh, but also, there's probably going to be adoption after that as well. Adoption. There's also... Um, there is a couple things that Hearthfire brought, so I'm going to try to touch on each one. But uh, again, this is just giving you the basics on furnishing and getting the goods. So like I said, you need to stockpile with the blacksmiths and the um, the goods stores like Berta or Britta in uh, uh, Winterhold and Bellathor in Win Whiterun and stuff like that. So uh, yeah, in the next video I'm going to show you uh, the building. Well, I, I'll have the mannequins built, but I'm going to fill them up and I'm going to also show you a little of the trophy room. That one was pretty Pretty cool. Uh, you can uh, make f statues of uh, different um, enemies and whatnot, like you know, just trophies like heads on the walls that you've taken down and whatnot. Uh, so if you're interested in that, check out for that new video coming soon. Uh, this is just giving you the furnishings, and I'm also going to give you a run through of the house when I after I'm done building it and all that, and show you the cellar and whatnot. <laughs> Uh, so if you guys like this, give it a like, and uh, always just get a bunch of iron fittings. That's, oh, man, that was so annoying. I just kept running out. Uh, anyway, like I said, give it a like if you like this, and look forward to the next video. Uh, I'm going to be showing you all the armory stuff and the trophy room. Uh, not much to do with the alchemy tower, but it is kind of neat. Uh, anyway, as always, peeps, stay gaming, and uh, keep on building.